this is an important moment, first of all, to recognize the National Transitional Council and the role they will be playing in taking Libya forward. And we've got to be led by them in this because it's very important that the Libyan people determine their own future. What we need is order restored on the streets of Libya, but we also need to provide assistance to that National Transitional Council. For example, unfreezing uh, the assets that they have so that they can get the money flowing in from oil uh, that is possible for Libya. So I think today's a good day, uh, an important day to mark new leadership in Libya, new leadership that we wanted to see. And let's also remember the role that British service personnel have played in enforcing that no-fly zone, protecting civilians, and making possible that transition that we want to see from, if you like, a popular revolt in Libya to stable uh, democratic government for the future.